tonight on the 6 o'clock Sunday Driver News. First story, 54 Chevy truck. Will they get it running? Or will they screw the pooch on this one too? Also coming, exploding logos. Screaming children. A mustache. All this and more on this episode of There you go. Well, this is it. 1954 Chevy 3800. It's a one ton. I'm going to work it hard. <laughs> I've wanted one of these since high school. And I've got one now. But it ain't worth uh, <laughs> it's All it is is yard art until I get it running. So let's go see uh, what I got to do. Well, here's the interior. Uh, it's, <laughs> it looks rough, but it's awesome looking. So, we'll, uh, <laughs> it stinks. Uh, it smells like a frat house in here. Uh, we'll have to throw battery in it. Um, I know there's a rat's nest also in the uh, bell housing and the clutch assembly and all that fun stuff. So, we'll have to clean that out. And I think the starter is going to need a little love too. So, we'll do that and uh, let's go from there and see what happens. Well, took the starter out. I uh, cleaned it up a little bit. I don't. I don't know. I don't whole, have a ton of faith that it's going to work, but we'll see. I tried to clean it up with the uh, brushes and whatnot, so we'll see what happens. Okay, sun's going down. Starter's back in. Let's give it a test. Got a battery in it. A charger. Let's see what happens. Hit that pedal. Oh, it turns over. Let's put some gas in it and see what happens. Okay, I got a little gas. Okay. Let's see what happens. Cross your fingers, folks. Okay. Key is on. My finger's blocking the camera. It's perfect. Here we go. Nothing. It's pointing. Okay. We're going to a little more gas in it. Where am I here? Alright, let's do it again. Try again. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Two pedal it. Get a little gas. spark okay I've got no spark whatsoever I've got an idea and I can fix that okay as you can see <laughs> I just did direct power to the coil because I didn't have any I didn't have any power going there it looked like we're gonna add a little bit of gas we're just gonna go for it on the gate we're gonna see what happens cross your fingers Clutch. Ah, she's in neutral. Here we go. As I block my fingers of the camera again. Nothing. Still nothing. Boomer. Okay, it's a oh, geez, the wind. Nothing I can do about nature. Um, I I got spark. I personally think it looks kind of weak. Um, so, I got my handy dandy Chevrolet truck shop manual book. Uh, if you're going to do one of these, I highly recommend it. It's full of all sorts of goodies and knowledge that you should know. 
So, uh, I did check my points. Uh, I got it to 19 thousandths exact with the feeler gauge. Um, but I do, I, the, I still think the spark is kind of weak, if I'm going to be honest. And it still will not fire. So the next step, um, check compression. And as you can see, I'll let you know how that goes. So I did the compression test and it all ranges between 40, uh, 40 uh, PSI to like 69 PSI. And when you check the book, it says after you've warmed up the engine, you're ready for a tune-up. It should be about 120, 130 PSI. So I'm a little below that. Um, so I'm going to have to do some engine work. That's okay, though. That's okay. That's obviously it's not going to run this week, not going to run today, um, or not anytime soon. But you know what? This is a truck that I've wanted for years. So I'll get it going. and can't win them all. But I will win this one. It's just going to take a little time. So... Man, that's a pristine ceiling, isn't it? <laughs> anyway, um, I'm sure I'll have more videos on this. So this is this truck is just still awesome to me. So anyway, talk to you. Bye bye. Okay, so this is Everett with his 1980 something. <laughs> okay, careful, careful. Ah. Uh, uh, Suzuki four-wheeler and we're getting running so you tell us what'd you do to it Everett? We of course it was dirty so we had to clean out the Honda engine which that was the dirtiest. Yep that was dirty the engine was very dirty. Mm -hmm. And the first thing we ever did was we got to we had to take off these parts and right now I had to clean one again because that one was a little bit too dirty. Yep. There's gas right there. We put some gas in it and we put fresh oil in it. Yeah, can you run it? <laughs> no, we can't run it right now because it's still not running right. We'll try to start it again later though. But we got spark and we got a little fuel in it. But right now it only runs when you choke it. So it tells me that it's uh, still starting for fuel. So. Pretty cool though, huh? Mm -hmm. yeah. So we'll get it running. You, gonna, you excited to use it? Yeah, how do you yep. unit? Well, you gotta turn it on. You gotta make sure it's on and then you gotta choke it if it's cold and then you pull it. So, but we'll give you more updates on this as we go. We'll, mm -hmm. so. Say bye to everyone. Bye. Bye.